This video is for netties. Help me bring this to their attention. I rarely ask for this, but like this video and watch it several times if you agree with what I'm saying. I want netties to take this seriously and I want to start getting us what we deserve. I have 15 things that I think needs to be addressed to make this game greater than ever. If you agree with this, you know what to do. If you don't agree or if you think I forgot something, please tell me in the comment. Now the stuff I want to talk about is mostly larger stuff, stuff that impacts the whole game, but you will see that I will include smaller stuff as well. So netties, open your ears. Number one, a good hauling job. There is no use for freighters unless you're moving PI like large amount. Implement commodities that we can haul around sold by NPCs in different areas for different prices. This way people who wants to play this game as a hauler can buy stuff in one area, fill up their freighter or their hauler and auto jump for like 4 hours, like 30 jumps and make 20 million or whatever. They would be more inclined to bring other people's stuff while they're still going that way to make extra isk. Crunch the numbers and make that happen. Number 2. A working market. Today, industry folks make very low ISK. This is due to many reasons, but one big reason is the insurance. Ship needs to blow up and disappear, otherwise we will just flood the market with ships. I know insurance put a buy order on the market, but that is also very low in price. So there is no value in building a large portion of the ships that we already have. We need a living market where stuff comes and goes. If people lost their ships, they would need to buy new ones. Number three, insurance needs to be changed. Don't give back our items, just give back the haul if that is what you need. Make it more expensive, I'm sorry guys, but the truth is my 1.2 billion raven insured cost me about 250 to 300 mil when I lose it. This takes away the fear I would have if I'd lost 1.2 billion. Even if I lost 700 million, it would be better than 300. And I'm strictly talking about the excitement and the anxiety that I have in some areas in this game. Not the paying part. It, it's way better to lose less ISK. Also, getting the items where you're claiming the insurance is very bad. At least make us pick up the individual items where they got bought from the insurance. This would make the world, um, the universe seem larger. For... Losec must have something that puts people there. Right now Losec is the area for PvP and missions, but with the scanning introduced into Echo's story missions are more inconvenient than before. Did we need that? Why not keep the stories in Highsec? Add instead a new type of mission that you can do in Losec. This would be a more PvP type one for people who want to do some even harder content and more risk. Don't mess up the story mission people's income like this. 5. Add more diverse mining ship. Yes, there is more ships coming for mining arriving with T10, but the bonuses the ship has is way too low. The ships we use now are pumped to the max, worth over a billion. Now putting that ship away for a new ship that is barely not an upgrade is not fun. This will only mean that we need to fit that ship with another billion to be better than the previous ship that we have. So I got an idea. Since Net is already making big differences in EVE Echoes then EVE Online which is good, why not continue on that path? Give us faction barges, uh, faction ventures, something like that. Make something interesting with this. This way we are more for putting up more risk into the ships. I'm just spitballing here, but for example say a Garista bar. Since it's close to a rattlesnake, it could have a great tank, so like 30% more resist and shield. A Sanja bar could have great mining abilities, like 30% more yield, you get the point. Make us farm for our trophies. Number 6. Fix the contracts. I never use it, it's boring to look at, and everything that is sold are skins and scams. Just fix it. 7. Where's the story of Eve Echoes? This might not feel so important to some of you people, but if you have a great story, then all your expansion can involve some lore. This not only make a great intro, but also helps us emerge within the world. 
make stuff happen. News feed selectable in the login screen, add stuff that we can find in space that has a story behind. This is a great addition to scanning by the way. People could fly around and scanning for these new things, try to find them all, you know, like Pokemon. Also, while we're talking about scanning, number eight. Scanning was a good addition overall to Echoes. It made Losek a bit scarier, but some people just love scanning for stuff. Why not add stuff they can find that makes them isk as well? Now make your own thing and don't just copy Eve Online. You can contact me if you need help with ideas but make more stuff for scanning. Nine, can you stop with the Concord? This was just bad and very hurtful to the game. We are already paying for Omega and now this. I assume they feel that there's too many people that paying the game with ISK. So that's why they needed to add this. You know, something we can't use the Plex to get. It's just a very poor solution. Making players miss stuff if they don't pay, it's close to forcing us to pay. 10. More events please. The Halloween event was a great thing they did. But the Christmas thing was uh, so bad. Now it's soon Halloween again. But I was hoping to see one event every three months or something like that. Why not have that to make us do stuff different compared to every other day. 11. Station containers needs to be added. This has been talked about. I think they will give us that. But we really need it right now. We also need to name them. Don't forget that. And while you do that, make us able to name our ships as well. 12. Make it so that when you're watching your own market items, you can easily click on the item to get to the market page for that item to see if the prices has changed. 13. Add a bounty system. The bounty system shall only apply if it has been carried out in low set. For example, if you get blown up, then the killer will get a bounty on his head upon your death that other players will get upon his death. The bounty value can either be based of a percentage of the valued kill mail or something we can decide to put ourselves. When killing someone with a bounty, it's important that the amount of bounty claimed has to be suitable for his own loss. If he dies in a frigate, you don't get the whole bounty, pretty much. 14. Decrease market update to within 24 hours. Once a week is just bad. 15. Up the percentage of making dead space gear. 30% is way too bad. Make it at least 60. This way we can create more B types and use up the overwhelming amount of C type gear that is. Okay. I know some of this stuff might not suit everyone, but this is my opinion. I hope you all agree to some of the stuff at least. Feel there needs to be more changes or other changes please tell me in the comment and i see you guys next time